Hello everybody and welcome back to RimWorld Beta 19 Merciless Naked Brutality. So in the last episode we dealt with our very first Scyther attack uh, from the mechs obviously and there was a, quite a few of them. They were all, uh, there were six of them and they were all the melee version of them. Uh, but we dealt with them relatively, you know, free of major issues. We took a bit of damage and we lost two turrets but the turrets, you know, gave us a bit of time. Uh, although they did end up causing us actually extra problems because one of them blew through the wall. Uh, but, yeah, overall, things are going pretty good still. We have lots of food coming in. We are overloaded. We got enough carpet to, uh, enough cloth, rather, to finish up our carpets in here. Our prison room is ready to go for any prisoners. Right now, it did go into medical, but we'll, uh, we'll get a proper medical room up and running. We did a caravan to go and grab as much materials as we can from the other base, and we just sent another one out at the end of the last episode, uh, and they are on their way. So, we're gonna be doing two trips today. We're gonna grab, for one, all of the wood we could carry. We're going to bring it back, and then we're going to go out one more time to grab all the traps that are existent there. And we have a fire. Oh yeah, and we're also getting raided right here, uh, so that's a bit of a problem. So, it doesn't matter, I'm not too worried. I'd prefer if you hit traps, though. But uh, the fire shouldn't be that big of a deal. It is raining, and rain does seem to affect fire on walls. Which I didn't think was a thing, but it did put out the fire that, you know, spread over here the last time. Uh, but we should be here soon, so we'll defend it. Uh, and that way we don't lose all the stuff. All right, so either way, things are looking good, though. Oh, and there you go, you're down. Uh, are you worth taking, uh, for one, are we going to get here in time? Four hours, probably not. And you're addicted to drugs, so that's not a good idea. Although, we do get some drugs, which is nice. Uh, okay, so we are here. We should be able to come put this out real quick. Uh, we're going to want our animals coming into area two. And we're just going to take shit and go. All of our pemmican is right here. Why last time did it not give us the option to take that? I was wondering where the fuck all that pemmican went that we took with us. Okay, so we, it's all here. I don't know why, but it is here. Oh, we also have uh, a gazelle. So we'll, it's going to rot in 2.1 day. We could take that and go. Uh, are you guys coming in? Yes, it's just all the way on the opposite corner. Why did you come in that corner when we entered the tile technically over here based on the world map? Excuse me. Uh, based on the world map. I don't know. Okay, and that just went out. Uh, so we do got some steel there, so we'll take that. Uh, so we're going to want to haul this stuff in. Everyone's going to take a bit of a nappy nap, which isn't a big deal. I don't want you to unload anything, though, because that's kind of a pain in the ass. Now, they might unload stuff and then make it so we have to pick it all back up. That may have been what happened here, is that we didn't unload before we left. So they unloaded and then reloaded and then left. But obviously that stuff was already part of the caravan, so they didn't really see it. Uh, so let's uh, force an unload. Uh, we'll wait for you guys to come in here, since this is the majority of the area you're allowed. Uh, we have a meteorite. What is that made of? Lump of silver. And that is up on this tile as well. Uh, I don't really care to go grab... It's silver's nice, but that's all the way on the opposite side, and I don't want to spend more time doing this than we actually have to. Uh, so you three will be fine. Uh, but we can... Uh, we're going to want this instead. Clear anima area too, that way you guys have to come into here. Uh, and also animals. Okay, everyone is told. So you guys will just come into that area. Alright. We'll get that unloaded real quick. And you need to wake up so we can get you to come in as well. Uh, although, technically, if, if I remember correctly, we can say do that. And switch back. And now you should come in here. Okay, uh, so then we'll unload all that. And then we should be ready to load up again. Just pure wood. Uh, you did die, of course. Uh, we want that bolt action rifle. It's not super great, but we'll take it. Uh, can you come and haul that real quick, please? And we'll also grab this as well once you drop that off. All right, and we are ready to go. So, uh, we'll go uh, back to the caravan. We're going to want to form everyone. All animals, plus the doubles. Uh, we're going to want all that pemmican, wake up, uh, steel we'll take with us, and then just the load of wood. Uh, bolt action rifle we'll take too, uh, and then just all the wood we could carry. So that's another 1900. So next time, the traps and the rest of the wood, and we should be good to go. And we'll uh, grab the steel from the vents as well. But other than that, we should be good. Oh, that's a wooden chest table. That's excellent. Uh, let's take that. Okay, so that should be good. Uh, oh my god. I fucking hate that so much. Okay, good to go. All right. Beautiful. And then we just have this to deal with. Uh, and you guys shouldn't have too much of a problem with this. It's just a quick pack up of all the wood. 
All right, so yeah, next time we'll come back, grab all these vents, the rest of the wood, pick up all the traps as well. Is that one of ours? Uh, gut worm, that may... Shit. Uh, DK, okay, none of you are here. So you're all gonna go here and get your treatment. But you're gonna eat through a lot of food. Luckily, we have a lot of food, so it's not really a concern. Shit. That, on the other hand, we're about to leave. Um, I'd prefer it if we didn't have to deal with them. And it didn't say it cancelled anything, because they're not attacking just yet. Can we GTFO? Yes, thank you. And if they torch the base, they torch the base. I'm not too worried about it. We got most of the stuff. Okay, and you guys are on your way. Uh, now, are you all going to get fucked by traps? We have lots still. All we need is enough of you. Yeah, there's the fire. Okay, so we're going to end up losing the base. I'm not too worried about it. We'll just call it a loss. Because we're not going to come back for a... Well, all of it should torch. But we're not going to come back for the bit of steel. We couldn't get it on the other map. Uh, so you guys can just do whatever, and then we'll close this tile down. Ha! <laughs> that was unexpected. <laughs> Alright. Well, it happens. At least we got that caravan out of there. We could have easily fought them, but... And we could have took a prisoner or two, but it's fine. It's fine. So that's good. Uh, can we just abandon this? Yes, we can. Okay, so we don't even have to worry about that. Alright, so we only have the one tile now. All of you animals can come into area one. Uh, and actually, I want you in area two so we can do an unload. But at least we have a fuck ton of wood now, so we don't even have to do any wood stuff for a while. So that means we can start getting our granite walls up and running. It's going to take a while because it is granite after all. And I want to defend the crops first. Uh, and we could actually take even more area for crops. So what we're going to do is set this up to there. Uh, we'll set that up to there. Uh, and we want that there. So that's all wrapped around there. Uh, we could have that going to right there. And then do we want to do like that or like that? Uh, preferably more is better. Of course, my mouse is doing the piece of shit thing that it does when it doesn't want to function. I don't want to do that. I want to cancel. Cancel. Mouse is doing that stupid thing where it likes to click a million times. Uh, so we'll bring that down there. So that is going to be our base. Gives us room for expansion without having to push the walls out. Uh, we are also going to want some doors. And we'll set up trap systems around them as well. Uh, so we'll set up granite doors. We're going to want access to this way. Uh, we're going to want access down here. So that'll be fine. We're going to want access down here. Uh, that should be easily trappable. And we want access this way. So we'll get all that made up. And then we'll set up this. Fuck. That's the problem, too. We lost... Well, you know what? We got all that wood. We can make new traps. I going to say, we just lost all of our other traps. But it's fine. It's fine. Don't need to concern ourselves with that. We got tons. Uh, and you are cutting stone. Okay, good. Keep making granite. Okay, and we got all of this getting grown again, which is nice, too. Okay, we're in a good position. Once we get our defenses up, we should be good to go for quite some time. Okay. Beautiful. Beautiful. Miss Draftwood. Why did you sleep out here? Is that an animal area for some reason? Because there's multiple on there. Yes, it is. I don't know how that ended up as one time. They're all stacked right there. Um, can we get you guys to go area one, which should wake you up, and then back to area two so we can unload? Yeah, I have no idea why they decided to do that. Okay, uh, and we actually won't have the inventory space for all this, or the storage space. So we are going to want to do an expansion as well. Uh, and then gear, drop it all off. I wish I could just say all of them, just drop all stuff, but you cannot. So gear, drop. Uh, yeah, that's why I had it paused. Because they move. Okay, we got pemmican back. Uh, and then, oh god, we have a lot of muffalo. Okay, so now we can go on here. Can you come in? Uh, now we can go on any adventure we want, since we have everything dealt with that we need to deal with. Uh, you also still have stuff. So that looks like everything. Okay, so we're going to need to expand. Uh, the plan was to expand this out to here, but we want to. We might want to expand it up and north a little bit as well. Uh, so we'll push this up to here, and then we'll start mining this out, get a hallway, and then our wall will go across here, all the way to probably about here. And then that'll give us room for a room for crafting-related, you know, stuff. Uh, and then the rest of this will be storage. And we'll just kind of work with it as we go. Uh, and then refrigerator's going well. 
I also kind of want to dig out a chunk of mountain somewhere. Uh, we can remove a bit of the roof here, uh, just so we can see how big... Oh, uh, we don't need to remove it. Yeah. It might be worth filling this in so we don't get bugs. Uh, bugs shouldn't spawn here unless there's other places... Uh, unless there's no other places for them to spawn. But if we dig out a chunk of mountain somewhere, give them a reason to spawn, uh, that would be nice. So we'll have to do that. Swifty, you are not so swift. Uh, wow. Probably major food poisoning? Yeah. You have a lot of issues. And gut worms and food poisoning. Not a good combo. You are going to be eating like crazy. And when you eat, you're going to throw it all up. Okay, well that's all going to get done. Uh, we don't need these sandstone chunks here. We'll move that out. Alright. Alright. Good. And we've got geothermal coming up soon. So we'll have power here. That's going to be uh, within our walls as well. That looks like about it. But that's fine. We'll get all this set up. Uh, that plasteel needs to get mined up, but that's not really high priority. Yeah, we got everything we need. Beautiful, beautiful. Uh, we could use some more meat, though. Actually, no, we um, we do want to be making, since we have a lot of food, lavish meals if we have the ability to make lavish meals. And we'll also set up fine meals ahead. That way, if someone doesn't have the skill for lavish, they'll do fine instead of that. Uh, so we're going to want that to... Uh, let's go to 100 as well, 100 fine meals, and then we'll do simple meals after the pemmican, uh, but pemmican is going to have a higher priority, uh, but that's only if we have the meat for it, so if we don't have meat and veggie, then it'll go into simple meal. Uh, we are also going to want to get kibble up and running at some point as well, so that is going to be kibble for do forever, that is going to use just the meat for vegetarian. Oh, we can use all different stuff for that now. Before it used to be just hay. Uh, so we don't want vegetarian. We only want meat for the insects. So we'll stack that up. Uh, where is insect meat? Right there. So that should be good. And we don't want animal products either because that'll be milk. So if we have both hay and kibble, then that'll be good. And uh, hay should be allowed in here? Yes. But we only want to save that for winter. Uh, and all these animals can now go outside since we unloaded them. And you can't, because there's no way out. There you go. Okay, so that's good. Uh, we are going to have to trim these walls down a bit. But at least we got that covered. Uh, so now we can start some mining. So we're going to leave that stone wall there. And we'll leave that there. But we'll mine that out. Which shouldn't cause any collapse. It should all be supported. And then we'll smooth that off, smooth that off. We'll have this hallway continue. We'll dig ourselves a little bit of an opening here. So we can exit this way. Um, and that should be good. Uh, animals, why are you... Oh, you're going around into there. Okay, we could trim that down. Whoops. Uh, area there. You no longer need to go there. There's not a whole lot going there, but that's fine. Uh, and then crematorium. We're going to get that going as soon as we have our new area set up here. Uh, and this stockpile can now extend into here. And we'll clean that up as we go. But at least for now, that'll make sure we uh, can haul shit that needs hauling. Alright, everything's beautiful, and a lot of the growing is getting done as well. And our walls are moving along nicely. Uh, how is our granite? Still lots coming in. Uh, we have struck compact machinery. Wasn't that already exposed? I'm pretty sure it was. <laughs> whatever, whatever. Okay, well either way, we're all... Everything's fine and dandy. It feels good. Until we get raided by mechs with centipedes and shit, but at least we're getting our defenses up. Uh, speaking of defenses up, um, for now these will not be a priority, so once we get this going, then we'll get our traps along these, that way they're defended a little bit better as well. Uh, and we are going to want to set up a system that's safer, um, that way we can exit without having to walk through traps. You know, we'll be fine. It shouldn't be that hard. Basically the same system that we had before, just, you know, better. Uh, and we have Swifty, who is starving. Yeah, it's because you have the gut worms and all that. Alright. So, is there anything in here that we want to use right now? Some more bed rolls would be nice. That way, if we go on a larger caravan, we can do that. Uh, we got some wake up if we need it. Uh, everyone should be, uh, for one, set on attack on site, which is another option that you can click and hold. Uh, same with social drugs. Uh, if we set that to, like, no drugs, we can just click and drag on that too, which is glorious. Uh, but we'll set them all to social and just manage the social drug policy. 
uh, which should already be set up to penoxicillin and usage if you have an addiction. Good. Good, 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 good. Everything's beautiful. All right. Yeah, I like that. We're in a good position for now. I jinx it by saying that. Uh, this also needs to now be told, uh, what do we want to grow? Berries would, <laughs> I was going to say, it would shut up, uh, I, procrastinator? No, that doesn't sound right. I think it starts with a P. A, a guy in the comments is very uh, addicted to berries. Would Probably wouldn't shut him up. He'd be like, more berries. But um, we could get berries going. But we don't really need them since we're turning everything into meals. Uh, we could get some drugs going. Because then we can sell that or smoke it ourselves for some extra joy. Because drugs did seem to have a pretty... Based on the drugs that we've seen, we could also work on actual drugs. Because uh, the, the amount of money you could get from them is quite high. Um, let's go... Since we're okay for food for right now. Although winter. We do want to make sure we have more than enough food for winter. Let's uh, get a cornfield going. And then we'll decide next spring if we want to do drugs. Because we have this whole area that we can also work with too. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm okay with people having that problem. And that's almost done. So we're going to want to haul that out once we're done. Um, and then traps we don't want to do just yet. Is this... It's almost done. We just have that little bit left. Uh, we can also set these up to get mined. Just get it done. That way we have it done. Uh, we do also have a bit of steel here. Uh, so we can set deconstruct up for that. And then we'll remove the floors as well. Because that's quite a bit of steel there. Alright. And uh, what workbenches do we have available? Uh, we do have a smelter. Probably not a bad idea to get going. That way we could start smelting some chunks for more steel. Because we are running out of nearby steel. Uh, we're also going to have to set up new trade beacons for all of this. And then we'll uh, rearrange these benches. Because all these benches can get moved now in vanilla. Uh, we'll rearrange them once we get a room up and running. Alright. And we can use that to smelt shit weapons. And crematorium. We'll get that going right now too before I forget. Uh, so that's going to take a bunch of materials... Uh, granted, is something that we have reliably coming in because we have it set up. Uh, so we'll use that since we're almost on our walls anyway. So we'll get that set up here and we'll get rid of all the tainted clothing. This is where I wish I had mending. That way I can remove it myself by fixing stuff up. But whatever. Uh, okay, so then that's all done. Uh, so we're going to want a hallway going up to here. And then for now, we'll have that as a dead end. Uh, days, that's fine. Mental break, uh, disease, yak. A lot of people are having a bit of a hard time, which is where drugs would have been nice, but whatever. Uh, we do have an excellent chess table, which, uh, what's that? That is also excellent. Uh, we'll add that in somewhere else after. Um, and then we do want to smooth out the walls if we're going to be using them like that. Uh, so we can do smooth that right there. We'll smooth that right there. Also get that if they'll do the corner. Uh, Mad Boom Rat shouldn't be a problem. Because it can't see us and we have no reason to go out. But it's actually going to hunt us down. Uh, which shouldn't be that big of a... Where'd it go? Oh, it's down here. Oh, Confused Raccoon. Okay, that's fine. You should be able to kill it. Should being the key word there. Uh, we did get a shot off already. Come on. Ah, uh, you're getting bit. I don't want you to punch it because then you'll catch on fire. And it is basically as fast as we are. Okay, so we'll uh, grab a bit of distance and then get one one round uh, one round of shots off. And then we'll uh, be good. We'll just punch it, I guess. There we go. That's what I was hoping for. Okay, and uh, before you go in, can you stand right here and put that out, please? No, you don't want to... I know it's not a home zone, but you should still punch it if it's beside you. Don't stand on top. Why, why would you stand on the fire? No, you don't want to do it at all. Can you not put out fires? Uh, yes. No, of course not. Okay. Uh, so we just won't worry about that. Because we won't get out before it's destroyed. Alright, and the walls are now done. Okay, and uh, how much granite do we have? Not much left. Uh, this is done. Okay, so we just got to get enough granite going to uh, do this top wall. Which shouldn't be that big of a deal. And then we'll get a million traps up and running. Uh, that plasteel is coming in quick, so we can get research for better benches. We have that unlocked, right? Yes, so we should get that. We need a bigger room here. So we'll find a way to do that. And I would like proper bedrooms. Barracks, uh, still negative. 
Spacious interior, attended party. Yeah, you don't really care overall, but you are getting disturbed sleep still. Although disturbed sleep's not as bad as it used to be. At least I remember it being worse. And recreation unfulfilled. So we could also work on a better room overall. Uh, so we're going to be building into this area. So what we're going to do is uh, no more sewing here. We'll get this done because we're going to need to get that geothermal in. Uh, Swifty, that's fine. We'll get the geothermal in, work buildings around that. Uh, we might just move bedrooms right off, off over here and then find a new spot for animals altogether. And that way we have room to expand stuff from in here. That way we have a dining room, we have a trade room. Uh, research can have a proper room with, you know, bonuses and the all that shit. We're going to need to get a medical room up and running. Uh, this is ready to go. So what we're going to do is destroy weapons. Uh, what weapons and how do we want to do this? Uh, we could get rid of everything that's less than normal. So that would be poor or worse. Uh, we'd want to do that forever. So we could say, and melee weapons, the vanilla, not vanilla, but the... Uh, Tribal stuff can all go. We'll keep a knife, though. Although getting maces might be a better idea. Let's uh, keep the knives. Or we could get a longsword instead. But we'd have to make them. Yeah, we'll uh, keep longswords. Uh, and then ranged weapon. None of them. Uh, and, okay, so we're going to want... All ranged... Uh, all melee weapons except for the longsword. And we're going to want a new bill for destroy weapon. Smelt weapons is a better thing to do. And we actually get our shit. Uh, so we want no range, keep the longsword, do everything else. Okay. Uh, and then we want smelt weapons again for ranged. Uh, so we'll turn those off just so they don't get all confused. Uh, ranged of... Uh, awful to pour for, I guess, everything except for triples um, and doomsday. We want to keep those no matter what. Also, charge rifle might be worth keeping and charge lance might be worth keeping. Are charge lances weapons you could actually use now? Interesting. So we'll keep those no matter what, but we'll destroy all these if they're below that. Even if they're full health, that'll be fine. Um, and then we want that to be forever, and we also want to... Is, oh, I'm looking here. Oh, that has a back now with a door, which makes me not want to do that. Uh, we're going to want to burn all apparel, do forever, if it's tainted. Everything else will sell. And then I'm assuming... Oh, if it's tainted, it'll follow the same rules. So if it's tainted, it gets destroyed because you can't sell it and you can't use it. Well, you can use it, but you shouldn't use it. Uh, so that's good. And then we'll also cremate corpses... Do forever. Everything except for colonists. Um, and that should be fine. And animals we don't really want to get rid of because we want all that. Okay, and then we could start digging these up as well and getting those torched. Alright, so that's good. That's good. Everything's a beautiful situation. Uh, power's on the, the off side now that we have these going. Uh, Polyus is now dazed. Either way... It's looking good. Uh, hey, we successfully tamed the Negasloth. Good. Good, 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 good. Uh, also, we want to set up... Whoops. Smelt slag. We want to do that forever, but within limits. Uh, so range would be... Something like that. Yeah, something like that. That way it's only going to be within our stockpile. And then we'll allow... Uh, this stockpile to take slag. So chunks, steal slag. So we'll set up slag to come in here if it has nowhere else to go. That way we can get stuff moved in. We'll actually get that done. Do you have to confuse raccoon? Do you have to be like this? Okay, we're fine. Everything's still good. And we do need a way to get rid of these scythers. But that's not a big deal. We'll just deal with that later. And then you're smoothing this out. Okay, so uh, we are going to want to uh, food binge. That's fine. Uh, we're going to shrink this zone here. So our room is going to be... My mouse wouldn't be a bitch. Uh, let's have our crafting room about that big. Which is still going to be too big for that in one thing. Uh, but that should be okay. 
And then all that will get moved and we'll set our walls up on that. Actually, you know what? Let's bring it right out to here. Uh, we want to shrink zone. Oh, I did. Durr. Oh, and I actually got rid of all that. Okay, so it kind of freaked out a bit. Um, okay, so that's fine. We'll just move all of this into here. And we'll stockpile, extend that out into here. And we'll trim that down to about here. And that'll be our crafting room. Then we'll remove that, or at least some of it. Uh, Flash Storm, are you, how close are you? Right beside us. Uh, our animals also need more room for food. Uh, so we will allow... Uh, we don't want to clear... Uh, Wargas hunted a muffalo. Do you have to? Poly oh god, our crops are on fire too. Uh, all of you, can you wake up for a sec? Diseased yak? Uh, we'll get Swifties slow as shit. Uh, Angst Tiger and Amvel, can you come out and kill the warg, please? We are going to lose the baby, it's not a big deal. But at least we'll get some meat. We'll get the meat. Alright. We definitely want to keep some range off of this. Uh, and it doesn't help all these other animals exist in this same area. Let's go up here instead. See if we get a proper line of sight. Fuck. Fuck off. Goddamn animals. Okay. Oh god, you guys are working on that. Uh, can we all shoot this? And now it's revenge. And everyone's gonna shoot. Okay, we're good. Free to go. And get that fire out, please. All right, so we're good again. We just lost that. Uh, Polyus luckily didn't get bit. We'll grab all that in. Uh, and then we're going to want to mine out. Now, we are going to end up possibly having a bug problem over here. Uh, but we'll mine... Mine? I clicked it. I clicked it. I know I did. Uh, we don't want that, actually. Don't do that. We'll just keep mining this out and have our power continue on in here. At least until we get the geothermal up and running, which should be soon. But we definitely want to keep everything going. Uh, so that's all good. Everything's going good. It's been very smooth. Uh, we also need animals. You need to be area one, please. And that fire is eating through all of your guys' food. Um, we'll just wait. We can get you out here if we have to, or somewhere out here. And, oh, it got darker. I thought it was going to be rain coming in. Apparently not. All right. All right, everything's beautiful. Uh, and then we've got fire coming in. Duh, why do we have to deal with this? Such a pain in the ass. Uh, Doe self-tamed. You mean dinner self-tamed? Uh, so you could come into area there and just get slaughtered. Yeah, 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 fire. All over here. Uh, what's that? That's all marble. You guys have to make it difficult. Okay, at least it's put out there, and that's just going to keep spreading and eating all that. Uh, and we are coming up to fall sum- well, we're halfway through summer. Which is fine. We got Grant still coming in. Uh, Jack Spratt, where are you going for granite? Of course. Whenever I want to find something like that, people go off and do other things instead. Uh, smelting weapon. Okay, so that might be all the granite. Uh, no, Amvel. Uh, Amvel, where did you go for that? Not granite there. Where are you going? How far are we? I could set up rules on distance. Of course. Why would you... Why would you eat rice? Or potatoes, rather. Oh, now you're doing... Limestone. Okay, so that's all the granite again? Oh, someone else did the job. Son of a bitch! You guys doing this makes it really difficult to see who's... Where you guys are grabbing it from. Because someone grabs the job... Okay, we can fix that by uh, dropping that on the floor. Uh, look everywhere. We can stockpile four. Uh, if we just drop it on the floor, and we can also tell one individual person to do it. There's a lot more control here too, which is nice. Um, if we tell one person to do it, you'll just drop it so the next person will be preferably the same person that just did it. Because it's not helping trying to figure out where people are getting this when we can't actually tell. And now no one's doing it. Of course. Of course. Alright. <laughs> Whatever. You guys make it all difficult. Uh, animals, we are basically out of food out here, but uh, they're not starving yet. Once the starvation starts, we'll give them a new area. Because they are still finding some grass. Uh, this is now done as well, so we can build a new one. Uh, oh, we are out of steel. 
Okay, so we'll uh, haul that. We're going to want to haul that. Uh, and we need steel coming in. So we already got all that. Do have steel right here. And some more right there. And some components. Uh, so we can set up mining. Mining. So we'll grab that. We'll set up all of that as well. We'll see how far that goes in. We've got fire. We do need to extend this hallway down. Not a big priority. It's not hurting anything and we're not really using it for anything either. Okay. Good, 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 good. Everything's just great. Keep saying this until it's not. Um, and then this shit's still getting hauled. It's going to take a while for him to move it all out. And we also need to get a floor in here. Uh, how much cloth do we have? Uh, actually, you know what? We're going to save the cloth because we're going to need it for bedrooms once we get real bedrooms up. Uh, rare thrombos. Do we want to try to kill these for their horns? And a lot of meat and good expensive fur. Might not be a bad idea. Uh, Dan, you are not having a good day. Uh, did you just... No. Uh, insulted, ate raw food. Why are you... We can't make lavish meals anymore. But you should... There should still be someone making simple meals. We have lots of cooks. They're doing handling, but there's not that much handling to do. Um, okay, well, wildlife it is. Uh, so, yeah, we're gonna go kill those real quick. Uh, so, can everybody, except for Dan... Where'd you go? Right over here. Uh, and Fluff, because you can't do it. Can you all come out and just fuck these up real quick? Okay, there you go. So we'll attack that one first. Uh, and you don't have a weapon, Polyus. Uh, and you shouldn't be a part of this anyway. So, uh, you're just free to go. We have to get you a melee weapon at some point. Uh, no. No, 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 no. You're gonna get fucked because of my mistake. I forgot that you're attack on sight without a weapon. And then we have one left to do. So you're free to go. Go get your medical. And we'll go and start shooting that one. We should be able to take it. It might come in and do some damage. But we could get Confused Raccoon to bait. And it's dead. Okay, so that's good. That's good. We can set that up for hunt. And that'll get taken in. Uh, allowed. Alright. There's some meat. And that'll be our meals again. And we don't need that or that. And then we'll set up proper hunting as well. That's a good start. Okay. Good stuff. Good stuff. And you get finished and in. Okay, and we just need someone butchering that up. Anybody? Polyus, you fuck. I hate it so much when people don't want to get treatment uh, and disease yak. And that's not because of bed rests, because patient is a high priority, but yet they're like, I want to play chess because I'm a fucking idiot. <laughs> oh, it's always infuriating when they don't do that. Like, I, I would get it if it's a bed rest thing, but it's not. Because even if you turn bed rest to one, it's still not going to trump other things like that are, like, what they want to do. Again, there's a ton of meat. Yeah, we got a lot of meat out of that. And that was just the one. And then we got two horns. Now, what are the value of these now? Ah, uh, they used to be, like, 3,000 each. It's okay. They are a good melee weapon, or they used to be. Uh, yeah, 10.3. might be worth using it as a weapon. Uh, two seconds per attack. Uh, we have two different... Oh, never mind. Okay, so it's 28 base damage. Um, Polyus, do you want to use that? It's a really good melee weapon. It's worth 800 bucks, so it's a bit of an expensive melee weapon. But it's pretty good compared to pretty much every other option. Uh, which I wouldn't be able to see because we'd have to be able to make them. And we don't have any other melee weapon options around. Uh, Plasteel. Okay. Okay, and that's not a problem. Alright, and our crops are coming in as well. Uh, we have cloth sitting out here rotting. Oh, I never did turn that on for corn shit. I set it to corn. Didn't... Fuck. Didn't turn it on. Incompetent cook. Sorry, confused raccoon. Our cooks suck. Uh, and we need more people cooking. Good people. We have so many people that can cook. The only things that are ahead of them are wardening, which is nobody doing anything, and handling, which is how much fucking handling can that many animals need? Got a second one up and running. 
That way two people can cook at the same time, because apparently one isn't keeping up. And most of the time it's empty anyway, because they're idiots. But at least we'll get two up and running. Which, I guess for a colony this size, it makes sense that two is kind of needed. Fine, it's my fault, I take the blame. Alright, this is why we need bulk meals, so we can cook quicker. But no mods, Confused Raccoon, what are you doing? You're grabbing granite from there. Why would you... I hate pathfinding sometimes. Because you should not have had a reason to go all the way up there and then all the way down here. But it's the way the grid system works for the game and how it determines quickest route. Because uh, smaller grids would mean more pathfinding expense. Well, it sure is a good thing that uh, we don't have batteries hooked up. Or else that could have been nasty. And we have an extreme mental break for Fluff. Uh, Fluff, you are slow as shit. And food poisoning, psychic tolerance. Yeah. And, okay, stop doing stuff. Just go eat. Thank you. Okay, so everything's back going. We just need a lot of hauling. Yeah, right now it's mostly hauling. We need all that hauled, all of this hauled. Uh, Colonist needs treatment. Swifty for what? Oh, gut worms still. And we could use some bionics, so we're going to have to start taking missions again, which is fine. Uh, I do want to get that wall finished up. We do have all the granite we need, so we'll start getting those walls. Where did all the wood go? We have 2,000. Left? How do we... Why is that not showing up here? Oh, that's not technically in a stockpile. But still, we brought like 3,000 over. I guess we're using a bunch for these. And we did build these walls. Alright, whatever. Whatever. It's fine. And we're going to want to haul all this shit in. Uh, Psychic Soothe. Always nice. Feel good testicles. Alright, and this is going to need bills. Uh, so, we'll set this one to simple meal. Uh, fine meal. Pemmican. And then we're going to want lavish meals priority. Whoops. Priority, and then fine meals, and then pemmican. Uh, that is going to be due until we have, due until we have. Pemmican is due forever, as long as we have the extra materials for it. And then simple meals is due until we have. Uh, we're going to want that 100, 100, 100, which should be the same. Yes, it is. And there is no, there is copy-paste now in vanilla. Although, how would we copy-paste that? We have to copy each one and then paste them individually. We can't just copy a whole set. Really? Why wouldn't there be a full copy? I don't know. I, I want to test it, but I don't want to fuck them up because they're actually working. Uh, okay, well, uh, we are at time. So we're going to go ahead and end it off here. Next episode, we're going to deal with that. Oh my god, you just got fucked, Amvel. Uh, we're going to need an attack squad. We're going to deal with that next episode. Uh, and then we're going to get all of this crap moved in. Uh, we're going to get this moved. We're going to get the floors up in here. Get these walls put in so that way we have a proper crafting room. Uh, continue making food again. And get our walls up and defenses for traps all up and running. And then hope that we have enough food for the winter. But we'll see. We should. We should. We'll get another two harvests before it starts getting real cold. Winter it isn't really that bad on this tile. We could even try to grow potatoes, which tend to do all right with the cool. So we could do that and see if they'll survive the negative, like, five that we get most of the time. Unless we get a cold snap. In that case, we're fucked. Uh, but either way, that is going to be it for today. So thank you, everybody, for watching. And hope you all have a great day. See ya.